Well, tonight, Huntsville Utilities spoke with the City Council to explain the decision to initiate a rolling blackout during the coldest days of 2022. Thousands of customers in the dark as temperatures dipped as low as 3 degrees during the Christmas weekend. News 19's Archie Snowden joins us live at City Hall and has the latest on the presentation. Well, Greg and Emily asking folks to cut down on power and heat during one of the coldest days of the year nearly backfired on Huntsville Utilities, but temporarily cutting power is what a rolling blackout was designed to do. Now, according to Huntsville Utilities CEO West Kelly, the reason for the blackout was a high demand for power on and on Saturday, December 24th at 5 a.m. TVA called for a 5% reduction load. Now, the issue was the temperature outside was falling rapidly and TVA asked power companies across North Alabama to implement rolling blackouts blackouts over the weekend to prevent that grid from failing. Up to 127,000 customers were impacted by the blackout, which Kelly says also was related in part to pipes bursting in homes and businesses. Kelly explained that the city to city council that there was much concern entering the step 50 of TVA's load curtailment program, which he adds was a first ever is also the first time in nearly a century that North Alabama in North Alabama that a rolling blackout had to be implemented. Because it was the first time it was done, uh, it did take some time to get ourselves put together, but the team responded very quickly, and you saw that efficiency implemented on Saturday when the rolling blackouts were implemented, and indeed with the future improvements that we will make, I have no doubt about our ability to continue to meet whatever responsibilities we have to meet to keep our regional grid stable. Now, Kelly added that the plan is to continue to build substations to better handle those power overloads, and most of those substations are expected to be completed within the next year. For now, we're live at City Hall in Huntsville. Archie Snowden, News 19.